So when you're talking about diversity and, and uh, conversation, communication, linguists will tell you three important things. One of which is that words don't have an absolute meaning. Another of which is that words change over time. You've heard us talk about that on the radio a lot. And the other thing is that what a word means depends on who's doing the talking and who's doing the listening. So this is, this is Holly from Indianapolis. I was actually calling um, about my incredible hatred, incredible aversion to the word. I can't even say it. Can I spell it? <laughs> Wait, you can't say it? Ooh. I really, really can't. It, what is I, it? I will if you will say it with me. Uh, uh, let me spell it. <laughs> <laughs> Can we say this on the radio? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. It's not, oh, okay, it's okay. not an obscene word at all. Okay. It makes my flesh crawl. Oh, my goodness. Okay, okay ready? M-O-I-S-T. Moist? Oh, Moist? my Lord. Grant, please. <laughs> <laughs> I hate this word so much. Oh, oh Holly. Um, but <laughs> I don't know. Is Holly here tonight? <laughs> uh, I guess not. But are there any people in Holly's camp? Are there any haters of the word moist in this in this group? One. Okay. Usually it's about one in five. It, this is a case of what we call word aversion. It's a visceral reaction that some people have to a certain kind of word. Some people hate, really hate the word slacks. Go figure. Anybody hate the word slacks here? Okay. <laughs> Did I see one? No. Okay. But this is called word aversion. And weirdly enough, linguists have been looking into this. There have been linguists um, all around the country since we aired that show. Uh, at Oberlin, I think, and elsewhere, who have been looking into, well, is it the diphthong? What, what is it? But, but um, probably not, because we also have words like rejoice, which sounds sort of the same. Um, probably it, it has to do with what it's associated with. E even the most innocent sounding word can sometimes really affect people. Um, whatever the meaning was for Holly um, isn't the same meaning for the rest of us. 